I remember my, my uh, you know, my stepfather, you know, would beat me and he, you know, he would beat me with extension cords and, and, and hangers and, you know, pieces of wood and all kinds of stuff. And, you know, after every beating, he would tell me, you know, it hurt me more than it hurt you. And, you know, I only did it because I love you. It was kind of, you know, it communicated the wrong message to me about what love was. So for many years, you know, I thought that love was supposed to hurt. And um, I hurt everyone that I love. And I measured love by how much pain someone would take from me. Um, and it wasn't until I came to prison in an environment that is devoid of love that I began to have some sort of understanding about what it actually was and was not. And I met someone um, and she gave me my first real insight into what love was because she saw past my conditions. And the fact that I was in prison with a life sentence for murder, not, and not only for murder, but for doing the worst kind of murder that a man can do, murdering a woman and a child. And it was Agnes, the mother and grandmother of Patricia and Chris, the woman and child that I murdered, who gave me my best lesson about love because by all rights, she should hate me. But she didn't. And you know, over the course of time and through the journey that we took, <laughs> that's been pretty amazing. She gave me love and <clears throat> She taught me what it was.